So Soul Systems is a solar energy development financing company, 10 years old, founded in 2008, uh, develop and finance projects all across the country. We've done, delivered 700 megawatts total to a variety of customers, municipalities, schools, churches, uh, national corporates like Amazon, uh, and you know different small businesses across the country, obviously. Here in Nebraska, we're focused primarily on public power. Um, so we've been around for 10 years, 700 megawatts of projects we've developed. Um, we also have uh, asset management capabilities, and we manage around $650 million of assets uh, in our asset management funds as well. So when you come to Soul Systems, we are... We started out doing SREX, which is something most of you have probably never heard of. It's an East Coast financing and incentive tool. Um, as we developed over time, we realized you know, there's a better way to get into the market where we can make a larger impact, have a greater success uh, with our projects. And that evolved into this full suite of services where we're doing the development, financing, construction with partners like GenPro <laughs> and the asset management. Um, so we're involved through the full life cycle of a project. My role is in that early development and you know, financing capabilities. Um, we then partner with someone like GenPro to come in and build the system, you know, help us with that local development as well. Um, and then we'll own the project long term either through a fund that we have uh, with Nationwide Insurance, who's been one of our best uh, financing partners over the last six years, um, or sell our projects to you know third-party investors um, that have tax-efficient capital uh, to take advantage of the projects. So what have we done so far here in Nebraska? Molly kind of highlighted a few of these projects already, um, but when we started our development business, we wanted to, you know, go into areas where we thought we could, you know, really make a significant impact. Um, you know, we're developing projects in Massachusetts and all of, you know, the major markets that you hear across the country, but Nebraska was a really exciting one for us to work in, um, and we got exposed to this market through the first project that we did uh, with GenPro, which was the Lexington project, four megawatts uh, with Lexington Municipal Utility, a wholesale customer of, of NPPD, um, and that was our first jump into this market. To be completely honest with you, I, if you had asked me when I started my career in solar seven years ago if I would be developing projects in the middle of the country, particularly in Nebraska, I probably would have laughed in your face and said no. Um, but here we are today, and it's incredible to be at a conference like this with, with so many people like you guys and to see the excitement around developing projects. So Lexington was our first jump um, into solar here in the state. Uh, it's a PPA project, so we provide you know third-party financing options. GenPro does cash and obviously finance deals through us, but we're really focused on that PPA um, and providing benefits to the customer through the power purchase agreement. So Lexington was the first project that we did. Um, maybe we'll see if you were paying attention to Molly's presentation. What was the second project that we did that she mentioned was turned online last week and is now producing energy? Oh, that was, that was fast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So, uh, unfortunately, I put this presentation together before <laughs> the project was completed, but that's what it looked like a few months ago. Um, this is a you know similar project to Lexington um, in that it's a municipal utility uh, looking to take advantage of a power purchase agreement uh, and the low-cost energy that we can provide through a project like this. This one is a megawatt AC, 1.3 DC, um, really viewed, I think, uh, Tim would probably say this if he's in the room too, but as a you know starter project for them, uh, they wanted to. Everyone's been talking about solar. They wanted to see what it was like, you know, put a one megawatt system on their grid, and then 
watch and see what, what happens over the next few years. So hopefully we'll be doing more with them because um, that plot of land in particular is a, is a really nice one. Um, and then our third project here that we are currently working on and in development with, I'm hoping we're gonna execute a PPA with Dave very soon, um, <laughs> is the Scotts Bluff project. Um, so the first two are you know, municipal utility customers, wholesale customers. Uh, Scotts Bluff is a retail customer of NPPD. Um, we're financing this project through their community solar program, um, which honestly, you gotta give NPPD a lot of credit. We've worked all, all across the country in various different incentive programs, various different community solar programs, and this is one of the more straightforward uh, programs that we've worked in, and NPPD has been a great partner for us throughout this process, so uh, major kudos to them for developing a program that, that makes a lot of sense for their customers. So these are the projects that uh, we've worked on in the state so far. Um, we're you know, hoping to do more through, through PPAs, um, and you know, that's our primary way of financing projects. Uh, not to bore you with too many details on this, but, and most of you probably understand this, but just wanted to give a quick overview of really what we're looking at here. Um, Soul Systems, uh, with GenPro, you know, is able to really provide you with the full suite that you need for this project. We'll take care of all of the development, the financing. All you got to worry about is the price that we provide you and executing a contract saying that you'll guarantee payments for, for what's produced from the system. So this is a quick chart to, you know, outline how it works. Um, and then to go over briefly, why a PPA might benefit you compared to a cash deal. Um, no upfront capital costs. Uh, if you have money that you're able to spend on, on a project, uh, then more power to you, because the, the LCOE for those systems is very attractive. Uh, but we recognize that not every municipality, uh, municipal utility is in that situation. Um, so the PPA provides you with an opportunity to not put out any upfront capital. We take care of all the costs. We install and, and construct the system, and, and you're just paying us cheap electricity for cheap payments for uh, for that electricity produced. The next is a long-term hedge um, and potential demand savings. This one in particular uh, is tied to the Lexington project. That was a lot of the re this is a lot of reason why Joe from Lexington decided to go solar. We were providing him with a 25 or 30 year PPA at a fixed rate. Um, we may have been slightly higher than what he's currently paying, but over those 25, 30 years, the life of the system, you know, he's gonna see some significant savings. Um, so willing to you know, take that uh, potential hit upfront in the first couple of years for that savings long term. Um, and then one thing that, this was the first time we really did this for a customer, but looked at their demand savings. All of our systems that we've done here in Nebraska are tracked projects. Um, so they can hit you know, your peaks throughout the day and, and really allow to provide you with some demand savings. So that obviously can you know, be taken advantage of for both a cash or, or a finance system, but definitely something that we're seeing a lot of value in here in Nebraska. Limited risk. We take care of all the risk for you. Pretty straightforward. Um, and then the tax credits, which Adam will probably get into a little bit more too and we'll ask some questions on. But, um, you know, we have tax efficient investors. We have a fund that's able to take advantage of the tax credits. You know, municipalities and municipal utilities can't do that. And it's, you know, leaving a, a fairly large incentive on the table. We can take care of, we can take that, take advantage of that tax credit and really help drive down the costs of, of the PPA that we're providing you. And then economic development opportunity, um, just for solar in general, and I think the lunch discussion will, will cover this, but it's a huge opportunity in, in a lot of these communities to have solar um, in an area that can be seen and, and accessed by your community so that they can point to and say, hey, our community's green. Hey, I'm saving money on my bill because of that system. Um, it's, it's been pretty great to see, and you know, for a lot of communities will help drive business, bring you know, more people to your town and uh, is a you know, really, really big driver for going solar. My last plug, this is a report from uh, the National Trade Association for Solar. 
our goal, um, Molly and I are, are out here developing and building projects so that one day Nebraska can be on this list. And we hope that all of you will help us get there. So thanks for your time. Next up, Adam Cohen. <laughs>